and I jumped up and down, up and down, and shouted, my dream came true, my dream came true, my dream came true. <laughs> My name is Jess elzef and I'm the Development Officer for Frederick County Public Libraries. Back at the libraries, my team is busy working on the Summer Challenge, our annual summer reading program. It's our biggest, most highly anticipated event of the year. This event is really important for a number of reasons, and one of them is the Summer Slide, a phenomenon where when children are out of the classroom in the summer, they lose important academic and literacy skills. A situation only made worse over the last couple years during the pandemic. We know that there are many children in our community who are falling behind and struggling to keep up. The good news is that public library summer reading programs have been statistically proven to be successful in helping to combat the summer slide. Even more good news is that we're expecting summer challenge participation to increase this year, but we need your help. Prizes are an important part of the Summer Challenge program. They motivate our summer readers to reach their goals throughout the summer, and they spark an excitement for reading and lifelong learning. In the past, nearly all of our prizes have been donated by our generous corporate sponsors and our local business community. But it's not sustainable, and it's not something that we can do every year, so we're asking for your support. This summer, we'll be creating a wish list with six grand prize options for our loyal library supporters can sponsor a prize for the Summer Challenge. When you make a donation to the Summer Challenge, you're not just buying a toy. You're not buying a doll, and you're not buying a Chromebook. What you're buying is a little girl reading 20,000 minutes and working hard and the joy in her heart and the love for her library when she wins. Plan safe for the next story and the story after that, he waited for another story, but the children began to walk away. Story hour is over, little girl children. It's time to go. The man looked at the children. He looked at the story lady. He looked at the clothes books and he roared very loud. Ah! We looked at the prizes. Um, I had just looked through it and I didn't, I thought it would be something else that she, she saw, but she saw Melanie and she just was completely obsessed and she asked how it worked. What did it take to get, you know, the tickets? How many tickets can we get? Can you put them all in, you know, one thing? We went through all the rules of, of what summer reading looked like. Um, and so she read and she read and she read. It was the most amazing thing to get the call from Miss Sandra. She was jumping up and down, up and down, just like dreams come true. My dreams came true for so long. <laughs> That as, you know, especially considering everything that everyone sorry, had been through. Um, you know, it's very, very special to have you get to do something that you loved and worked so hard and wanted so much to actually have it come true. My name is Zoe. This is Nellie. I love to read. Yes. I like Me Mayhem and Jada Jones and the 13 Story Trios. I like Nancy Drews. And I like my red schools. They take me on adventures. Because they're really excited. You'll be so glad that you gave because the opportunity to encourage the kids in our community to reach their goals and read all summer long is a priceless gift. Your support is deeply appreciated by me, all my colleagues at the library, and all of our summer readers like Zoe.